this video is about some key pieces for your wardrobe in spring. So let's start off with the blue shirt. I think blue feels fresh. This one is in a more flowy material. But if you like more structure in the top, then you could choose a crispy cotton. It's absolutely timeless and they come back around every single year. You can dress it up or down and the color goes well together with a lot of other colors. Style it with a blue or cream jeans also goes well with black and white trousers. Next is a cardigan. This one is from H&M and it's short sleeved and cropped. It's quite a thick knit and you can wear it on its own or if it's a little bit chilly you can wear a long sleeved under. You can also wear it open or closed so there's a lot of different ways you can style it to get different looks. Third is a pair of jeans. I have chosen a high waisted light blue straight leg fit. There is a lot of styles that's in right now so choose the jean style that fit you the best because trends are moving so fast right now so don't stress about that. The most important is that you love the style. This piece goes with pretty much everything you have paired with a blazer, cardigan, long sleeve t-shirt. There are endless options for blue jeans. Next up is a pair of black trousers. This pair is old H&M. They have such a nice fabric. You can see and feel it's great quality. They are timeless and I love trousers. They are almost as comfortable as sweatpants in my opinion. Choose a style and cut that best suits you. I love high-waisted since I have a very long torso. They are very versatile and you can dress them up with a nice top and some kitten heels or dress down with a pair of sneakers and a t-shirt. Cable knit sweater. This one is 100% cotton from Samsu and Samsu. I like a little bit of a thinner sweater when it comes to spring. First, it's great for layering if it's colder and it's breathable because it's not polyester. So it goes well into the summer months also. Second is that you can do a full tuck when the sweater isn't too thick if you like that kind of look, which I certainly do. Last, a thin coat. Where I live, it's too cold to wear a trench coat yet, but if your weather allows it, then you can't go wrong with a trench coat. This one is in a brushed cotton, so it's not too hot even if it gets a little bit warmer. And if it gets colder, I'm just layering under it. A coat feels a little bit more elevated than a jacket for me. It's a very versatile piece and goes with a lot of different outfits. I love this coat and I would like a similar in a different color but a little bit longer. But it's so hard to find nice coats that's not in wool or polyester. And that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.